Hi everybody, uh, it's Mike. Part-time reselling in the Pittsburgh area. Today I'm gonna to show you a couple of things I got from fr the Free Cycle website. I'll tell you what Free Cycle website is, and I'll show you something I got at a local online auction that I hope to resell on eBay. Okay, first of all, Free Cycle got these uh, two ink cartridges, HP. Now their their date is from, from 2023, so they expired I guess last year, you could say, because now it's 2024. But if you go on eBay, you'll see that uh, people are selling ink cartridges that are years past the date, which I guess is okay because they're sealed. So I, I, I guess it's okay to, to buy them, right? I don't know if I would buy something that's years old, but a year or two, sure. What do I hope to get out of these? $10, $15. They're kind of all over the place and you got to figure out, obviously, the ones that have not expired go for more money. So the ones that expired in 2023 will go for a certain amount, and ones that expired in 2018 will go for a certain amount. So I gotta figure out, but somewhere around $10, $15. Now, uh, what is FreeCycle? So it's freecycle.org. They've been around for around 20 years or so, and it's kind of like Craigslist where different communities have different websites to go to. Uh, since I'm in Pittsburgh, then I use the Pittsburgh one, but see if there's one in your community or not. People just list things that they're giving away for free. Rather give it away to somebody who needs it than fill up a landfill or have it go to waste, and you could post things that you want to, and moving boxes or puzzles or whatever. Uh, I, I found a couple of things on here to uh, to resell. Not a lot, but every once in a while something pops up, like these ink cartridges. So I decided to uh, to grab those and, and give it a shot. So see if FreeCycle is uh, in your area and uh, just check it every once in a while. Uh, you just click on there and you can see maybe a better, better description. Some people don't put descriptions and pictures at all. Just So anyway, it's uh, just something you might want to check out as, a, as, a far, as far as a source for reselling. And from a local online auction, I got this NBA ba base kit. Is that how you say it? It's basket, but it's spelled weird. I don't know. Uh, I got this for uh, $6.50. So I don't know if there's a different way to say it. I'm just going to say NBA basket, even though there's a dash between the S and, and the K. Uh, this is a new improved model. <laughs> <laughs> uh, box is in pretty good condition. Uh, it's got a little bit of warping like older boxes get, but pretty much it's in great shape. Uh, here are all the rules and how to play. And here down the bottom, you see it's from uh, 1988. Uh, and as far, oh, there's the, these are the backboards that go at each end and the baskets go into those little notches there. And they'll score. Uh, came with, uh, open it up here, and it came with uh, both baskets, which is good. And came with the ball, which is good. <laughs> um, and it's, it's just kind of neat because you, 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 put the, you put the thing in the ball, or you put the ball in one of the holes, and it's got these levers here that work as like hammers, I guess you might call them. Uh, so when the ball falls into one of the holes, you give it a shot to try to shoot the basket. I'm not going to set up the whole thing, uh, but you get the idea. And what's uh, kind of neat is uh, the ones that are like not straight onto the basket, like the ones on the outside, uh, the hammer thingies are like angled. So it, you're not going to go straight when you like this one. It goes off towards the basket. So that's kind of neat. So you have to worry about it just falling off the wayside. But it's kind of neat. I'm glad uh, that I got it. And we'll see if we can resell it. So that is it. Thanks for watching. I appreciate it, and I'll talk to you later. Bye.